A group of women marched from Padang Merbo to the parliament building on Wednesday, demanding the release of Bursi 2.0 chairman Maria Chin Abdullah six days after her arrest. They handed over a petition on Maria's release to Minister in the Prime Minister's Department, Datuk Sri Dr. Shahidan Kasim. We actually put forward our demands. The first, of course, is Bebas uh, Maria. The second is to return all the property that belongs to Bursay that was unlawfully removed. Uh, and thirdly, it was to Manso Sosma, because Sosma is such a disgraceful law. Malaysians don't deserve a law, and in this case, severely abused. Maria's sister said she's not a terrorist and should not be detained under the Security Offences Special Measures Act, which the government had said would only be used for persons involved in terrorism. And I hope that the um, ministers will push for my sister's release. Okay? And I uh, thank you for coming and hope that you will keep supporting uh, Bebaskan Maria, Maria uh, functions. Bagan MP Lim Guan Eng said that AMNO members seem embarrassed to talk about the matter because they know that Maria's arrest cannot be justified by the government. This just shows that uh, the attitude uh, towards uh, dissent and also attitude towards women. Yeah. That uh, uh, that's why there's a need for Bersi. We have to bersihkan uh, otak and also bersihkan mulut mereka. Dr. Shaidan said he would forward the memorandum to the ministers and relevant authorities for further action. Saya tidak ada masalah sebab apa-apa saja yang orang bagi kita kami sebab kita pemimpin rakyat Malaysia yang terbuka kepada apa-apa saja pandangan. Dan tidak ada masalah ya. Yeah? Uh, tapi tak boleh guna saya untuk pakai kuning tak boleh. Saya punya ada baju tai merah. Maria was detained on November 18th on the eve of the Bursi 5 rally in Kuala Lumpur together with about a dozen activists. She's held in solitary confinement in the city and is not allowed an attorney in 28 days.